In this video we will look at creating Microsoft SysPrep deployment packages for use with VMware vCloud Director. This video is based on VMware Knowledge Base article 1026313. Before VMware vCloud Director can perform guest customization on virtual machines containing Windows based operating systems, you must create a Microsoft SysPrep deployment package on each cloud cell in your installation. These sysprep files allow for the customization of Windows based operating systems when virtual machines are being deployed from a vApp template. During installation VMware vCloud Director places some files in the sysprep folder on the Cloud Director server host. VMware vCloud Director can customize the network settings of the guest operating system of a virtual machine created from a vApp template. When you customize your guest operating system you can create and deploy multiple unique virtual machines based on the same vApp template without machine name or network conflicts. Let's look at the procedure for creating these packages. Here you can see that I have created a folder called My SysRev Files on the desktop area of my Red Hat system where vCloud Director is installed. In this folder I have several subfolders for each of the different Windows based operating systems and I have copied the SysPrep files from the default SysPrep folder over into these folders which I have created. To create the sysprep deployment packages, you will need to run the create sysprep package script by invoking the command as follows. In the guest customization directory, you should see the following files after being created. The file windows underscore deployment underscore package underscore sysprep dot cab contains the sysprep files and the vcloud underscore sysprep dot properties file denotes which sysprep images are installed. Let's have a look at the vcloud underscore sysprep.properties file. A value of 1 next to the operating system name indicates the sysprep package is installed for that operating system. We can check the slash var slash log slash messages log file for the successful creation of the sysprep packages. To do this, invoke the command grep minus i space create sysprep space slash var slash log slash messages. This concludes our look at creating sysprep packages for use with VMware vCloud Director. For further tutorial style videos, please check out the VMware Knowledge Base and the KBTV YouTube channel at the following links.